Hello there. Honey, happy Sunday. Y'all know what time it is? Story time. Yes. And now, before we get started with the story, today I thought, ooh, I want to show off the kids some of my favorite things to do while reading my stories when I'm by myself sometimes. I like to have a little healthy snack. An apple, sometimes I like cucumbers, some strawberries, or grapes. So, I encourage you, ask your mama, your daddy and them, your granny, granddaddy and them, uncle, aunt, whoever it is that's keeping you, all right, watching you and things. Ask them if you can have a little fresh fruits or veggies as a snack while you read. And sometimes it just makes it a little bit more fun. I promise you, honey, this, this is great. I have a little seed, but... Mm. But that's all right, because that's our business. Yes, but very good. So make sure you're eating your fresh fruit and your veggies. All right, very good. So I'm going to sit just to the side. I just wanted to share that with you guys. Now today, the story that I'm going to read. Oh, what would you say? Oh, we didn't sing the song. Well, baby, let's sing it then. Y'all ready? I said, come on in the room. I come on in the room. Hey, hey, Jesus is my doctor. And he writes out all of my prescriptions. And he brings me all of my medicine in my room. Honey, come on in this room, baby. And when you get in here, Go on, hit share. Yes, very good. Now, let's get to our story time. All right? Okay, so the name of this book is My Daddy Said I Can Be Anything. Look at that. And, honey, let me tell you why I'm excited to read this. Because I'm a daddy's girl. Oh, honey, I love my daddy, and my daddy loves me. And my daddy also told me I can be anything I want to be as well. And now I am anything I want to be. Yes, shall we read? Very good. Okay, let's get started. It is my daddy said I can be anything. Urban Moon Books. And this is by Fanita Moon Pen Pendleton and illustrated by Cameron Wilson. Can y'all see that? I'm trying not, not to get the glare on there. All right. Daddy, can I be a firefighter when I get big like you? Oh, son, you can be anything. Yes, you can. My daddy said I can be anything. Look at that. Yes, you can be anything. Daddy, do you think I can be a judge? Mm -hmm. Yes, son, you can be anything. Look at that. Well, daddy, do you think I could be an astronaut? Absolutely, son. You can be anything. Hey, Daddy, you think I could be a painter? Oh, absolutely, son. Yes, you can be anything. Daddy, do you think I could be a teacher? Oh, yes, son. You can be anything. Daddy, do you think I could be a football player? Why, yes, son, because you can be anything. <laughs> you better play that football. Daddy, do you think I could be a builder? Yes, son, you can be anything. Daddy, do you think I could be the president of the United States? Well, yes, son, you can be anything oh my goodness daddy do you think maybe i could be a baker yes son you could be anything daddy do you think i can be a singer yes son you can be anything daddy we have talked about a lot of different careers but I think I want to be a firefighter, just like you. Well, son, as long as you put in the hard work and you make no excuses, I know that you can be anything. Mm. 
the end. Very good, honey. Did we learn something from that? I hope so. And now I know it's a dad and his son here, but this applies to all of us. Boys, girls, ladies, young men. We can be anything. As long as we don't make excuses and we don't give up, we can be anything we want to if we just believe it and then we work hard to do it. Yes, very good. So anywho, that's it. We had a short story today, but I hope that you loved it. I hope that you learned something. I hope you're eating your fruits and your veggies and you are working on being anything you want to be. Yes, very good. Now, one other thing I want to tell you. If it just so happens that unfortunately somebody tells you you can't be anything that you want to be, don't you believe them, okay? As long as you believe, you can be anything you want to be. All right? Very good. Now, go about y'all business, baby. Mm, mm, mm. Have the most amazing day. But even if you can't have a good one, don't you dare go messing up nobody else's. Him, very good. I absolutely love you. What'd you say? Oh, we didn't talk about Donna? Oh, look at Donna. Got a little too big, too nice. I thought, oh, I'm sorry, honey. Ain't she cute? <laughs> With my avocado glasses and my earrings and my avocado and guacamole on my shirt. I won't go mention it. But since you did, <laughs> ain't I cute? And they just decided to do it. You know why? Because that's my business. Now, I'm going to get on out of here. Love y'all. Bye. <laughs>